guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Maddie and today I'm going to be sharing with you the most unlikable characters I've ever read about. And these are in no particular order. First I have Aspen from the Selection series by Carrie Cass. I love this series but I cannot stand Aspen. It may just be because I love the other character in the love triangle but regardless I cannot stand Aspen. He does get better as the series progresses but I just still there's something about him that I don't like. In this series he risks the life of himself and the main character all in the name of love and like if you love someone I don't feel like you would put them in a position to be killed. He also does the back and forth game messing with the main character's feelings and I'm not here for it. Next I have Edlin from the Selection series by Kara Cass. This series was originally a trilogy but then it got expanded and books four and five in the series follow the main character's daughter Edlin. She's the typical spoiled brat princess. She doesn't really care about anybody but herself. She's spoiled bratty stuck up and just flat out annoying. I have no idea why the author decided it would be a good idea to write her story. There's really not much to like about her at all. And then her romance arc wasn't even good in the first place so I really don't like books four and five. I love the original trilogy but cannot stand the rest of it. Next I have Adam from Shatter Me. I do not like Adam whatsoever. He was okay in the first book. He started going downhill in the second book and in the third book I could not stand him. He is so annoying. He tries to control the main character and act like she can't make decisions for herself. He tries to protect her when she's basically the most powerful one that exists. He treats her like she can't do anything for herself and then in the third book he makes a lot of comments that really angered me to my core. He just really turns into a crap character. I cannot stand him as a love interest, but I can't, I don't even like him as a character. Next, I have The Girl on the Train by Paula Hawkins. The main character of this story is an alcoholic, and she doesn't really remember anything about her life because she's just always drunk. She treats her friends and her family like crap. She literally is a stalker, but beyond that, she's just boring. Straight up boring. It's not the alcohol that makes her a bad character. She's just a bad character to begin with, and the author kind of paired that with alcoholism to kind of make you feel bad for her but it doesn't work in my opinion. <laughs> She's just unlikable. I don't know what else to say about her. Next, I have Jessamine from The Infernal Devices by Cassandra Clare. Most people begin to feel for Jessamine and start to like her character as the series progresses. That did not happen for me. She's a spoiled, entitled brat. She only thinks about herself. She makes terrible decisions. She makes decisions that could basically mean the end of the world, and she does it for personal gain. She never grew on me. Although she does come to later regret her decisions and starts to become a better person, I still just don't like her. Next I have Mal from Shadow and Bone by Leigh Bardugo. I was okay with Mal in the first book. I was okay with him in the second book too, but the third book just really made me realize how much I didn't actually like him. He's the best friend of the main character in this story, but he really does treat her like she doesn't matter. Basically, he knowingly stomps on her heart over and over and over again and then decides later that he made a mistake and that he actually cares for her. I didn't find it believable, to be honest. He feels very manipulative. It feels like he's fighting for power and control over the main character. The whole time, he's manipulating her feelings to get her to stay with him even though he doesn't want her anyway. It just doesn't sit well with me especially because he is one of the main love interests. You just don't treat someone you love like that whether you love them romantically or just as friends. You just don't do it. Don't like him. Next I have any of the characters in Looking for Alaska by John Green. I when I first read this book I thought I liked it because everyone else liked it and I was like oh of course I like it. Of course it's great because everyone else thinks it's great. And then I got to really thinking about it years later and I was like you know what? I couldn't stand that book. I had a hard time even finishing this book, so why would I say that I like it if I didn't actually enjoy it? I hated all the main characters, but I especially hated Alaska, who was supposed to be like the greatest person in the world, and the main character just loves her even though she's not even really a good friend. I just really don't like any of these characters. They're completely unlikable, every single one of them. Sorry for those of you who are John Green fans or sorry for those of you who actually like this book and like these characters. I just personally do not like them. Alright, that is it for this video today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more bookish content by me. And let me know in the comments down below who your least favorite characters are. I hope you all have a wonderful day and I will see you in my next video. Bye!